Hello guys, it's journalist Samuel Brand. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thousands of mourners on Friday thronged Wunda village in Rusinka Island, Oma Bay County, for the burial of renowned videographer Colin Sochin Kualam, who was also a town supporter of Gormaya. The emotional ceremony was attended by several prominent public figures, including Subanot and P. Milio Diambo, who delivered a special message to the bereaved family from Homa Bay Governor Gladys Wanga. Other distinguished guests who attended the ceremony included Nairobi based lawyer and politician Bran Waken, who emceed the event, Mohangla Maestro Prince Indaw, FC Leopard's Chairman Dan Shikanda, as well as Gurumaya Treasurer Salib Bolo, who represented Club Chairman Ambrose Chiera. There was also a huge presence of Gormaya fans, many of whom traveled from Nairo, Nairobi. Governor Johnson Sakaja did not attend the ceremony, but provided a bus and a van to ferry mourners from Nairobi to Rusinga Island for the burial. The funeral brought Rusinga Island to a standstill as thousands jostled for a space at its final resting place. Kuala, who is said to have never missed a single Gormaya march in the last decade, died on September 9th in a road accident at Londiani, Kericho County. His body arrived in Kisumu early on Thursday morning abroad a Kenya Airways flight for, for an overnight vigil at his rural home ahead of the burial. An entourage of mourners from Nairobi caused a traffic snarl-up in Mbita town on Thursday afternoon as they joined the funeral cottage on its way to the late Kuala's final resting place. During the funeral service, speaker after speaker eulogized the late Kuala as one who touched many lives and left a positive impression on those he interacted with during his lifetime. Politics also took center stage when Ms. Othiambu, who was the chief guest, seized the opportunity to lecture former allies of opposition leader Raila Odinga, who have shifted their allegiance to President William Bruto. Crowd Pula Prinsinda shared a heart wrench experience of how he learned about Kuala's demise as the disease was on its way to cover one of his shows in Busia County. Prinsinda recounted his last conversation with the deceased that, that tragic evening around 6.45 p.m. while the latter was en route to Busia. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more news updates.